The National Resistance Movement's National Delegates Conference met today in Amboli following earlier resolutions to end voting by secret ballot by the National Executive Council and the Central Executive Committee. The motion for the removal was tabled by Kabula County Member of Parliament, James Kakoza. He and a section of those in support of the motion defended it saying the method would enhance transparency and be cost effective. Last elections, we did well with the LOC one. With those few remarks, I want to say, by lining up, we are being consistent with what the past experience. During the previous elections, it was marred by violence, rigging, and cheating of the highest order. The National Party Chairman, President Museveni, concluded a three-hour and a half speech with a recommendation for the party to go the way of the National Executive Council for the greater good of the party. Many of the supporters are known, secret ballot or not. The question then is, what percentage are those discordant couples or those whose candidates' preference they prefer not to be known? It cannot be the majority. However, there were opposing voices too, especially from those who insisted that lining up would increase chaos and voter intimidation. This system could only work if we go in colleges. But where the candidate is not there, it, it doesn't work. Our members, they will suffer from brutality from their colleagues. It will block us the young people who are seeking for leadership. It took two rounds of calling for the vote for a clear-cut answer. May I ask you again, those in favor say aye. aye. Those in favor say nay. The eyes have it. <laughs> Meanwhile, the party secretary general, Justin Lumumba Kasule, was taken by surprise as section of the delegates Hekod and booed her. The chaos was started by delegates from Lango and Acholi sub-region. National Chairman, as Secretary General of the National Resistance Movement, I call on for your protection. There are two groups which appear to be unhappy. One group is this side, and another two from this side. You go and sit near my tent there. And after my speech, I will listen to your issues. The party secretariat has since released a statement condemning the act without mention of names. It is understood that the rare sections of the party who are keen for return to the previous practice of electing a secretary general as it was before 2015. The Secretary General and her staff are now appointed by the party chairperson. Jackson Onyango, NTV.